Hello dear traders and welcome to InstaForex TV channel. You're watching a weekly link up with me, Anna Kasatkina. We're going to discuss the ongoing situation on Forex with technical analyst Peter Yakimovich and forecast further moves of popular currency pairs. To sum up trading results of this week, the euro-dollar pair is again closing the week in the red. Fundamental data derails accuracy of technical analysis, which rests entirely on signals of technical indicators. This time, investors were alarmed by unexpectedly dovish rhetoric of the Federal Reserve. Hi, Peter. Do you foresee any changes in the dynamic of the most popular currency pair next week? Hello there, traders. Um, the euro versus US dollar basically went higher since my previous forecast and basically uh, price uh, tried to break the level of the 1.1420 it went and tested the 1.1440 but it failed to sustain the breakout of the resistance which basically um, which is a basically signal that uh, sellers uh, may act and uh, we basically see that there is a reaction from sellers so my advice is after to watch for uh, further selling opportunities now, uh, the upward trend line is still active and uh, my advice to watch for the breakout of this upward trend line and this will confirm the potential further downside on this currency pair. Uh, the downward target is set at the price of 1.1185, which is the key support level for the euro versus US dollar on the short term perspective. If you plan to sell, so watch for a breakout of the upward trend line, but also the protective stop can be placed at the price of 1.1460, which is again the key resistance level of this currency pair. So, watch for selling opportunities on the euro versus US dollar. At the same time, we close deals on the pound dollar pair with a 100 pips profit amid volatile trading due to Brexit developments. Do you expect the pound dollar pair to carry on with a downtrend? On the British pound versus US dollar, I found very interesting situation at the moment because there was a potential pip. Um, uh, a fifth wave and uh, the Wolf's wave pattern is basically present on this currency pair. The Wolf wave pattern suggests that the price may go lower based on the, on the current price action of the 4 hour time frame. So my advice is to watch for selling opportunities uh, on the British pound versus US dollar. The downward targets are set at the price of 1.2960. This level is basically key uh, support based on the price action, but the projection of this the whole way pattern is at the price of 1.2850. So there is a, actually a space of around 300 to 400 pips to catch if this pattern, uh, uh, if this pattern works. And uh, this pattern is actually very, very, very solid. And uh, in my opinion, uh, it's absolutely worth uh, trying uh, to sell the pound in the water potential a good return. Um, the, the level of 1.3 uh, 350 is the key resistance. So basically, you can place your uh, stop loss or protective a stop at that level, and then watch potential targets at the 1.2960 and the 1.2850. So again, watch for selling opportunities based on this pattern um, and based on the uh, on the action reaction principle. Watch for selling opportunities. Meanwhile, the New Zealand dollar is able to assert strength. Amid broad-based weakness of the US dollar, positive market sentiment on the Kiwi remains unaffected even by downbeat data from New Zealand. Do you see good prospects of trading the New Zealand dollar? And what currency pair with the Kiwi would you like to discuss? I decided to cover the New Zealand dollar, Canadian dollar, because uh, I see the very interesting opportunity on this currency pair. Uh, according to the daily time frame, I found there is a breakout of the rectangle pa pattern. Um, there is a 40 days, the price basically traded sideways uh, between the top and uh, low boundaries. And finally, the price managed a few days ago to break that. Then we got a retest, successful retest of the upper boundary, which is a basic sign that the New Zealand dollar may, um, makes, uh, may push uh, more higher. So, uh, also, the price is uh, trading above the 200 uh, moving average, which is a sign basically the overall long term trend is bullish. The upward projection, the upward target, is set at the price of 0 0.9350. And so, basically, there is a, about 150 pips space to catch. And with a, a, almost the same risk of around 150 pips, you can try to catch this 1 1 ratio and uh, with a very high odds um, to, to actually hit the target. So watch for buying opportunities with a target at 0 0.9350. 
Thank you, Peter, for your trading recommendations and see you next week. You've watched the link up on InstaForex TV channel with me, Anna Kasatkina, and Petr Yakimovic, technical analyst of InstaForex office in Serbia. We wish you always profitable trading and see you soon.